we're here at Gertz for the third anniversary of Flood Girl, and we're going to see what the crowd has to say. I'm Professor Norm Blunstein here on the Gertz line, uh, and we have some local Gertz patrons. Uh, so we're going to ask a couple questions. Is that okay with you guys? <laughs> I have a boyfriend. Yep. Cool, this is good. First, we're going to just do like random trivia about uh, like Gertz and Miguel. So, do either of you know when uh, <laughs> Gertz was founded? <laughs> oh my god, the microphone? I honestly have no clue. Like, I'm first year, I have no idea. 1857. Very close answer. Very close. Actually? Uh, no. Um, I know, I know this, okay? 1961. Okay. Oh. Say if I looked at 19... Um... 30s? 40s? 50s? 1968. You're close. 1821. 1983. 2001. 2003. I think it's 1848. Um, 100. Good question. 19... 70... 70... 70... 70... 70... 70... 70... 70... 70... No one really knows, but they think it was the 70s, so... How many beers could Woodchuck drink if a Woodchuck went to McGill? At least a hundred. I don't think I can beat that. Indeterminate amount. Tell you I'm sorry for breaking Are you hearing this? <laughs> well, it's pretty simple. A Woodchuck would drink as much beer as a Woodchuck could drink. Beer! And that's right. Today is the anniversary of Flood Girl. Flood Girl. That's, that's what we're all here for, yeah. right? Of course, of course. So, where do you think Flood Girl was going? Like, I think she was probably going to the SMU building based on where she, literally she was trying to cross. Well, sometimes the subway costs too much, so you can't afford the subway, so the easiest way is to go with the water. And just wherever it takes you, that's where you go. So, are you implying that Flood Girl was just riding the waves? Yeah. Would you have tried something like that in the circumstances? I think I would have, yes. I don't think anything more needs to be said about that. Gertz is the funnest place on the planet Earth. Gertz till it hurts. Gertz till it fucking hurts, yeah.